I apologize profusely. This is actually going to be my last video for tonight. Then I'm going to bed. So, I got a message from a psychic on Instagram. Um, I made this video before, but somebody ruined the video, so I deleted it. It's been one of my issues for tonight. So I'm going to make this short and sweet. The message was really quite simple. The message said that somebody in my family has cast a spell on me. It's going to make me die young. Well, there's good news there. I'm almost 50 years old. In 22 days, I will be 50 because on August the 23rd, that will be my 50th birthday. Yay. As for the other part of the note saying that all my kids would suffer. whoop de doo Guess what? I'm almost 50 years old. Kids are no longer a fucking option. They're not even an afterthought. Because I don't have any. I'm never going to have any. So, therefore, my kids are going to be safe because they're never going to come into existence. You know, I don't have a girlfriend. So, no girlfriend, no sex, no kids. You know, so y'all can see how much of a life I don't fucking have. But anyway, the bottom line is, I've eliminated two stones out of the psychic. I'm not going to say this woman is wrong. I don't have money to pay for a psychic reading. It's just not going to happen. You know, and if I had money, I would do it. But she got to give me some more concrete evidence. And before she comes at me with anything about the flawlessly beautiful and dangerously sexy Zeta Zang, Zeta doesn't know I exist. I'm in love with her, but she doesn't know I exist. So, as far as I know, she doesn't want kids. So, there's, there's, there's a win-win there. You know, so unless the psychic is like really, really psychic. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Last night you made a video about me. I told everybody that I told you. Which she did. It's on my phone somewhere. But if she don't come back at me with, um, I know who you are in love with. Well, here's the thing. Anybody who watches my videos can find out that I have a major league crush on Zeta Zang. Anybody on my Facebook can go back to every post I've ever done or saved to see that it's her. You know? So it's not like they won't be able to, to manipulate me and be like, yeah, you're going to marry her, etc., etc. As much as I would love that fantasy, it's a fantasy. I do believe in miracles, though. You know? And I'm not going to knock a psychic. But me dying young, I'm already like 22 days off of 50. In an hour, I'll be 21 days off of 50 because tomorrow will be August the 2nd. So it's not going to matter. No, I am not guaranteed to live past 55. Which can be considered young but considered old. I intend on making it to 60. And as long as I don't do anything stupid or go anywhere that can endanger my life, I might make it. Am I guaranteed? No. A plane can fly into my house tonight and I could die. So, But apparently somebody in my family is dabbling with magic and putting a curse on me. You can't curse the people who already are cursed. Alright? You really can't. Because it's going to cancel it out. I was born into a bad family. That was my first curse. I've never really had a decent day of life for myself. I've helped tons of people. I've never been able to help myself because other people keep getting in my way. So therefore, I also look at the positive. I'm going to let you know the positive. One thing, if I happen to die young, I don't know what people consider dying young. I consider dying in your 20s and your 30s young. I'm halfway to 100 now. So I don't think they can say if I died young. They can say whatever they want. If I do die between now and the age of 60, or if I don't reach 50, I'm free. There is death, and there is freedom in death. I'm not promoting suicide. Just know there is freedom in death. I think I'll make a song about that. Post them tomorrow. Thank you for watching. I'm your host, Echo Fan Grey Wolf. This is Comfort Habit number two. Be seeing you.